Michael, you average 15 points a game in your two-year career as a Saint. What part of your game has improved the most this season? Uh, I think I really try to improve my all-around game the most, like in terms of passing, rebounding, dribbling. I feel like last year, I did I did some more I did more things than shoot, but that was kind of what I based my game around. This year, I tried to expand on that. So. And Jared, you scored 30 points and shot six for seven from the three-point line in the win against ranked Texas Wesleyan in December. What memories stand out to you from that game? Uh, I have to say the basket was looking pretty big that day. I feel like I couldn't miss. Uh, I'm really happy we got that win. That was uh, one game we needed after what happened uh, early in the season against them. All right, this question is for both of you. How has head coach Chris Style and the staff made an impact on your life on and off the court? I mean, it, it sounds cheesy, but, like, they really are, like, they teach us more than just on-the-court stuff. Like, they teach us how to be a good man, good brother, everything like that. They really want us to be, like, good on and off the court. I'm going to have to agree with Mike. Uh, basketball, that's just something, but he's really, like, pushing you, like, to be a better man and, like, be a, a, a father in the future. That's what I love most about co all the coaches here, in at Olu. And the last question for both of you, when will you be graduating and what are your plans for after college? I'll be graduating in May and I hope to continue playing professionally overseas. If not, I'll probably be back here as a graduate assistant. I also graduate in May and uh, my plans are to uh, play professional overseas. All right, thank you guys, congratulations. The Saints beat Houston Tillotson 86-81 today to conclude their season. For Olu Saints Network, I'm Ryan. <laughs>